Coach, switching gears here, I mentioned before this interview, you're always going to be asked about this question no matter where you go. Your relationship with the Gilas Filipinas national team that abruptly and unexpectedly ended earlier this year. Personally, Coach, how do you feel about that? Well, I love the Gilas program. Um, you know, I, I came to the Philippines to be a part of the Gilas program. I've been in the Philippines going into my ninth year now, and seven of those years I've been a part of the Gilas program. And it really is the core reason that uh, I came to the Philippines, and I've enjoyed every moment with them. But you know, you don't always get what you want in life. And um, I consider myself extremely fortunate to be at Ateneo, and to have the opportunities I have at Ateneo. Uh, and the, the, the Gilas uh, scenario and the Gilas situation is what it is. And uh, you know, I will never go in depth into those issues that arose. Um, they were hurtful, they were difficult to handle, but you know, I, I pride myself on being professional. I could consider myself extremely fortunate to be employed by Boss MVP and his group, and that carries on through the Ateneo. And um, I'm not going to look backwards. I'm just going to look forwards, continue to do my job, and uh, be thankful and grateful for the opportunities that, that this organization, this gentleman have given me, and, and that I've been blessed by uh, the good Lord to, to have these opportunities.